How's it going guys? Welcome back to another Zwift race. This one is stage four of the monthly Zwift racing series, the Z racing series. Uh, this one is on a new course for me. Actually, I've never done this course. Uh, I've done it the reverse a couple of times, but um, this is on the, was it Duce France? Duce France? Something like that. Um, apologies on the pronunciation on that, but this is, yeah, stage four. Um, the flat is fast, and uh, yeah, so it has been fast so far. Um, if you have not seen the last video, um, I got absolutely destroyed in that race. I got dropped uh, about 10 minutes, 10 minutes into the race, um, and yeah, I mean, it, it, despite putting up some, um, for me anyway, what's uh, what I would consider decent decent numbers um i got yeah absolutely wrecked so uh yeah the goal this week was to um try to last longer than last week uh so last week i lasted about 10 minutes um and this one you know hopefully hopefully longer with the front pack we will see um and the so i did kind of scope out this course ahead of time and it is uh like they say mostly flat um but there is a little uh not even a hill a little rise i guess what you would say in in the middle um it's kind of i think right in the middle um and it is the the aqueduct so i've done it uh, again in the reverse a couple of times and it's actually worse in reverse uh, this way it's actually quite um quite mild but um quite mild for like an average ride is uh, certainly um quite fast for uh for this the b category here so um yeah my goal was to uh try to stick with the front pack until that climb and then i'm pretty sure on that climb slash hill rise whatever it is um that i would get uh I get pretty well, um, pretty well left in the dust there. So um, that was the that was the idea, and uh, it uh, it it works out. Um, I I kind of stick with the front pack for um, for the first half ish of the race up until about that uh, um, about that climb, um, and then yeah, uh, pretty quickly as soon as we hit that climb. I, uh, I, I get dropped. Um, so I will, uh, kind of just speed up the, the race. Uh, but, um, I will talk about some, talk about some numbers as, as we go. So, uh, for the first, uh, about the first 15 minutes, um, which is, uh, about up until that, that little hill about till I get, uh, till I get dropped, I average about 3.6 ish. I really tried to, um, try to conserve energy as much as, much as possible in the, the pack. I mean, it actually mm, sort of works out for me, I guess, because, um, you know, last week I think I was doing 3.8 and I got dropped in 10 minutes. So this one, um, is a little bit, uh, maybe, maybe conserved energy a little bit better on this one. Um, but it's still, yeah, still got, um, got left in the dust really on that, that little climb. But, um, afterwards the, uh, well for the whole race, uh, I wind up, um, averaging about 3.4, which is pretty, uh, consistent for me over the past, um, the past, uh, couple of months, I guess. Um, so 3.4 tends to be what I, what I can do, um, for this like half hour to 40 minute ish race. Um, in this case, I wind up, uh, the like 40th on the road, um, and about 28th on, on Zwift power. But yeah, so I wound up uh, 3.4 and I'm, and I'm about two minutes behind the leader, a little less than two minutes behind the leader, um, which is better than last week. So I will take it, but, um, still, yeah, still, uh, <laughs> quite a, quite a ways back there. Um, the, uh, I do this week, um, unlike last week, I do wind up, uh, kind of hanging on to a, the sec, uh, not even the second group, the kind of third tiny little group on the road. There's uh, four of us that end up, uh, riding together for, um, kind of the last, uh, last third of the race. And, 
I don't end up doing any kind of sprint or anything like that at the end. Um, I didn't, I was really not feeling like pulling or anything in this, in this little group on the back. So I didn't feel like um, trying to beat anybody to the line because I was not doing my share of my share of the pulls. Um, but yeah, so I do uh, the number wise. Um, so like I said, 3.4 uh, and I do end up setting some nice power curve uh, PRs. So I end up uh, like 12 through 34 minutes, either matching my uh, my PR power for that that time or um, setting new ones. So yeah, I mean, I, I am I am improving, uh, which is good to see um still a little a little discouraging that uh you know i keep getting getting dropped on these but um i think that's to be expected you know i just just upgraded so there's a big big step up as most of the comments have been saying so like thank you for all the the you know the comments and the the kind kind words on those uh and the advice uh the step up from c to b category in zwift seems to be much greater than um some of the other category upgrades so i've uh, uh when i upgraded from d to c um i i definitely felt the the step up but uh this just seems yeah seems like it's a, a bigger step um and then people have commented from b to a it seems to be uh not quite as great of a step up so yeah um so i'm definitely finding that at the moment but uh i mean i think yeah just keep keep plugging away i'm also doing this uh training block too so the um the legs aren't the freshest for some of these races um but i think you know at the end of it i have you know another uh month and a half or so to go with that so at the end of it i should be should be stronger for it we will see but um, anyway, uh, thanks for watching on this one. Um, it's a little bit of a quick different one cause nothing really happens, but, um, I will, yeah, do stage five next week and then, um, you know, continue to update on the, all of the training progress. So thanks for watching. Um, go ahead and subscribe if you, uh, want to be updated and I will see you next time. Thanks.